In the previous video, there was a comment made by a user by the name of Taco Tron Burrito. What a delicious name, by the way, where they mentioned that this disco GitHub project has a Google collab which didn't work. I gave it a try and lo and behold, it didn't work for me either. I will leave a link to this GitHub page and you can give it a try and see if it works for you. I went through and made changes to fix all the errors I was getting. After going through the whole thing fixing the errors I received, I finally got it working. I will also leave a link to the modified Google Colab notebook that works for me. This is the Colab after I made the modifications. I will leave a link to this Colab in the description. Most of this video is just going to be me clicking on the play icon next to each cell until it completes. There are a lot of cells. I just made changes and added cells as I encountered errors. This notebook could probably be simplified as it contains a lot of cells and some redundancy, perhaps. Fun fact, I tried simplifying it but ended up breaking the whole thing, so I decided I will leave it as is where it was finally working for me. At the end of the Colab notebook, it will launch a Gradio web application where we can actually use the application. But first, we must go through all of these cells. I will find some lovely elevator music for you to listen to while you watch me click on cell buttons over and over again. Enjoy. Even though there are errors seen here, it does end up working in the end. I guess some dependency ended up upgrading the version of Torch and some other modules don't like that. Who knows? Ignore it and move on, I say. I also sometimes receive this message on the bottom saying I'm connected to a GPU runtime but I'm not utilizing the GPU. I don't want to change to a standard runtime because that will cause me to lose all of my progress. Click X on this message as the GPU is not being used for the installation process. Now we are finally in the final cell. This will create a Gradio web application and launch it on a public server for us to use. If you scroll down, you will see a URL to the application, along with a preview of it right below here. Click on the URL to open the Gradio demo application for this project. And here we are. This is the demo application. We can add our own images here if we want to, but for this video, I will just select the example images provided for us. I'm also going to select a sample pose provided. We can also provide our own that we can create with open pose or stable diffusion. Now let's click generate and scroll up to the top. This will basically take the input image of a person and a background and a pose and make an image that looks like that person in that pose with the background provided. 
And there it is. That is pretty cool. I think at some point they will be adding functionality to make entire videos from this in the demo so we can make a dance video. I might try installing this locally at some point. However, the acceleration modules used are not compatible on Windows, I don't think. So it would be an adventure to try to install this on Windows, I'm sure. I have uploaded the notebook I used to GitHub. You can click on this button to open it in Colab, and it will open the notebook in Google Colab. That is all. Enjoy!